Princeton Reunion, aka the second largest purchase of beer in the United States every year. This year, I volunteered to pick up trash for 15 hours to see what the hype was about. On Thursday morning, I headed up from Virginia to Princeton, New Jersey for $33 at 7 a.m. Now you may be wondering, what was your job? Well, my dream job was to be a golf cart driver, but I couldn't get hired, so I ended up being an eco rep, meaning I wore a neon yellow tank top and was in charge of making sure these compostable earth cups got placed into these orange bins. Not to be confused with recycling, because Princeton didn't have recycling at reunions. Anyways, the first day I was signed to 10th year reunions, aka everyone was 30 and not at Princeton yet. So I basically sat and watched the sunset for five hours. The next day was completely different. I was at the fifth year reunions booth and it was a Friday, so it was endless partying my entire five hour shift. The worst came when it started raining and it was pouring. So much so that all the trash bins and all the compost bins outside got completely filled with water. So not only did that mean during that shift, I had to pick up all the cups that people used in playing beer pong and literally just left it on the ground. Not only did I have to pick up all of that, I also had to empty both the trash and the compost containers because I would like sort the trash to make sure the compostable cups would actually go in the right bin. And my shoes, my open-toed sandals, and the mud, and the beer, and the water, I literally destroyed those shoes. The last day that I worked was Saturday, and I worked the 25th reunion booth in the morning, and that's basically all the families and all the kids and I didn't have to do anything because there were no earth cups there for some reason. But then in the afternoon, Princeton had its P-Raid, which is basically a parade of all the alum and they just go down the street. And the reason why I was there was because alum would just drink beer and then throw their cup on the ground. And we were in charge of picking that up. That actually wasn't a huge problem this year, but as we were walking around and looking for earth cups, we stumbled upon this. In case you can't really see what's going on, these ex-frat boys brought their own packs of beer and would throw them up in the air and someone would have to catch it. And when you didn't catch it, you would like lay down on this other pack of beer and get waterboarded, but with beer. And the worst part of all of this came when I watched Princeton security officers try to talk to them and they just like completely ignored them. Anyways, that was the end of my shifts. And later that day, I watched Shrek the Musical and saw lots of old people dancing, which made me forget about what happened earlier that day and somehow made reunions seem like it was worth it. And that is all to this video.